Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is Ruchi Chaudhary. Today I am going to cover some of the questions which are to be asked in the base that interview. The interviewers in the programming field used to ask the straightforward question. But the thing is, the SAS, it is a statistical analysis system which is used to perform analysis on the data, manage the data, or access the data. And it is very fast. So the people that people gets confused from where the questions will be. So there are few straightforward questions. If we answer them, whatever the interviewer are expecting us to answer, so the confidence level of our can easily be increased and we can move forward and increase the time of the interview. First and foremost question asked in the base says. First and foremost question is, what are the default statistics which are included in the PROC means? PROC means it is used to produce a statistical report. It mainly deals on the numeric variables and it only produces only the non-missing data values. We get five different default statistics when we are using this PROC mean. N, that is the non-missing observation, mean, that is minimum, maximum, mean, mean of the values, data values, and uh, last but not the least, that is standard deviation. Moving towards the next question, how we can include or exclude any of the variables to get printed in the final report? The straightforward answer for this question is, we can use drop and keep option in the data structure. If we want any of the variable which is newly created and if we want only those variables to be included in the final report, then we are used to assign a keep option. That is keep option, it is used to include any of the variable which we want in the final print. While if we don't want any of the variable to get included in the final print, we use drop option. So keep option, it is used for including the variables and the drop option, it is used for excluding the variables. Next question is, what is the difference between in file and input? For answering this particular question, we should have a little knowledge about the raw data files. We have various files other than SAS files like rich text files, PDF files, HTML files, Excel files in which already the data is there. But anyhow, we want that data to be included in the SAS environment and so that we can easily access that data. For that, we are including a in-file statement. That is, in-file statement, it is used to read the external file. And input statement, it is used to describe the variables to be included in the data set and which is present in the external file. Next question is, what is the difference between in formats and formats? In format, it is used to read the data and format, it is used to tell the SAS how we want to print the data or the variables in the final report. The last question which I want to include in this video is, how we can get a distinct count of the various data values? This answer can be described in various forms, like we can get the distinct count with the help of PROC FREAK also, PROC MEANS also, PROC SORT by using NO DUPE KEY and NO DUPE OPTION so that it will nullify the duplicate values and we can also get the distinct count with the help of PROC SQL by using the distinct option. I hope this video will be helpful for you all. Thank you for watching.